sucker's heavy. Um, I'm gonna do a little unboxing video because I just thought it'd be fun. I never thought to do one while something's actually boxed up. And um, I waited a very long time for this from the Kickstarter campaign. Like I imagine if you have this grinder, you are you were in a similar situation. So I guess the, anticip the anticipation level is high. Um, so I thought it'd, it'd just be sort of fun to do a very casual one take unboxing video. So I dropped it on the table to show you this sucker is heavy. It came in a, a another cardboard box, like things usually do, boxes within boxes. Um, man, just guessing, this thing probably weighs like, I don't know, 18 pounds? 80 pounds. 80 pounds. Um, maybe it says, I bet you, this doesn't really matter, but I'm curious. 21 pounds! Okay. My wife is probably making some lunch in the background. Don't, don't bother that. Very cool uh, little graphic on the front. I think, sort of common these days, little line drawing, but doesn't get old. Um, okay, oh, we got, got to turn it around. Oh man. It's okay. That's 3D printed, we can make another one. Did it break? No. Nope. Oh, the bottom is Okay. Um, oh man, I think it comes with a t-shirt. <laughs> what? Yeah. Oh man. That's hilarious. And I love it. It's like a little person, like a little uh, character. Oh. And it's really thick. The, 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 cotton but I think it's gonna be too big for me so yeah maybe maybe they'll take exchanges and it'll only take another year but that's pretty cool I didn't was not expecting that okay okay moving along um we've got a nice little manual very small uh and I'll just show you what's inside everything seems I think pretty nicely packed in some some foam some like uh, I guess I don't know what you call this foam but it's not like styrofoam I don't know if that's good or bad but I dig it it almost seems like you could keep the box and I don't know it seems like a box worth keeping for the foam inserts oh my gosh this sucker is heavy I bet you this weighs, yeah, like at least 15, 18 pounds. Way more than I was expecting. Um, sweet little catch cup. I think it's magnetic. Excited for that. Um, this looks like the hopper lid. A uh, little, never use these things, but a little bulb uh, air blaster thing. I guess to help with uh, retention or yeah this one's actually kind of cool it's got a little little thingy on it you can get in some deep places um <laughs> and a very thick power cord it's like looks like a 12 gauge no, 16 gauge, huh? Looks thicker than that, but thick cord. Um, and then the final thing, a, a nice little brush. Cool. Um, and that's it for the box. Looks like I scratched my table with the box. 
and this has been a very destructive video. Um, okay. Wow, this sucker is substantial. It's got this like, I mean, I've I'd seen videos and photos. Obviously, you know, before buying, but this thing is way, uh, here, I'll, uh, let's bring it in. But, uh, yeah, this, like, cast, I think it's cast, um, like, clear hopper thing, you know, I, I kind of don't, like, I want to not like it, because it doesn't seem very timeless, it seems sort of, art deco-y, but I love it. It's pretty, I mean, it's just like kind of, st it's stunning. And I don't usually like that word, but um, it's not immediately obvious. This thing seems doesn't, I don't know. There's a kind of like couple ways this one's to uh, catch cup this is very um, heavy like it seems heavier than it needs to be um, like it's it, it's definitely not like a I think they would call it a like a drawn piece of aluminum where they they stretch it, it seems um, either cast or machined because it's, it's very substantial. And then of course the, the magnet. That, yeah, that's, so that's one of the, I'd say maybe the most unique thing about this grinder. I mean, in my opinion, as far as like a fully new um, function or piece of technology innovation is this um, little clicking chaff finds releaser. And I think, yeah, you twist it and it sort of like, you know, raises something and then it springs down. I want to say almost like a pin, the ballpoint pin um, mechanism. Pretty cool. Excited to see how it uh, how it works. But super heavy. I think it's beautiful. I mean, I have heard people say it kind of looks like a sewing machine, which I think is hilarious and very true. A very top heavy sewing machine. Um, yeah, I remember from the button, or from the videos, thinking the button seemed like a little, like too much play, and that I think that's still true, but it feels substantial enough that I don't, I think it's it still works. Like, it doesn't wanna like, I think what I was worried about is if you didn't push it exactly in the center, if it would, um, I guess, bind and it doesn't really, so don't really mind that. Um, the action or the feel of the, the grind adjustment, it feels good. I kind of am wanting a more defined sound. Um, I just think like a nice click. sound would, would be kind of pleasant but it feels nice and then yeah like I remember it's pretty wild how this just comes off I don't think any other well I shouldn't I don't know most grinders you can't access the birds so easily and then this pin threads out I can't remember exactly how you set the zero, but I think it's 
pretty easy. So anyway, I think I'm going off too much. I'm gonna plug it in and we'll see how it sounds. All right, we got it plugged in. Man, check out that shirt. I love it. It's like Mickey Mouse meets coffee grinder. Yeah, that's kind of huge. They probably like just send sizes out based on your country. They're like, oh, he's American. He's probably a big dude. Okay. So, first time. Let's make sure the burrs aren't touching. Got it on two. Wow. That's... Very interesting sound. It's got like a soft start. It almost um, sounds really slow, but it's the RPMs around 1400, which is the max. We'll turn it to, uh, I guess this would be 1100. So it's 800, thousand. You know, I, interesting, well, that's a good thing. Almost sounds too quiet. Okay, let's put some beans. Put some beans in there. All right, so we're at yeah, 1100 RPMs. Very quiet. More, uh, I didn't spritz it with water or anything, but there's, I guess, more, um, static than I would expect. Um, and it almost seems like the RPMs kind of I don't know. I obviously can't say, but it almost seems like they ramp up once once uh, it can sense some, some that it's grinding something. And it turns off automatically. Um, well, I'm gonna, let's see. I think maybe something interesting would be a way, way to dose and grind to see about retention, um, and then I'll, sp I'll spritz it. So, uh, oh, my assistant, thank you. So this, I'll do uh, 15 grams. Okay, so I s sat down and started editing, um, and the sound sounded way more like whirly, almost like a jet engine, which is not how it sounds in real life. So I thought I'd try a different microphone and see if it sounds any different. It almost didn't sound as quiet on video as I think it does in person so I thought I'd, yeah just try it again
So just the motor, like right around 70. Okay, here's the, what do you call this thing? The Time Mower Sculptor 078. So this isn't, uh, this probably isn't fair. I should have them in the same room. Anyway, I don't know. People have probably done sound tests on YouTube, so this is really is sort of probably meaningless, but I'm just trying to show how quiet it is. More staticky than I expected. But if there's nothing, I don't know, I'm curious if the static is mostly in that little chute nozzle. I guess it, yeah. I'm curious if there's anything up there. Because if that's all it is, that's not very much. Um, okay. Fifteen point one grams, people. You could say that's satisfactory. All right, I think that concludes the unboxing video. We'll, uh, who knows? Maybe I'll never make another video again, but maybe I'll do some some tastes. But to me, that's pretty subjective. Like these taste tests, like. Depends on what kind of coffee, your water, how you're brewing it. I'm sure this thing makes great filter coffee. Um, anyway, bye. Thanks for watching if you watch this. Like and subscribe. Smash that like button.